what's up guys welcome back to another video so in today's video i'm going to be teaching you guys some insane strategies to help you out when grinding in jailbreak and also teach you a new method to get up to three hundred thousand dollars an hour without further ado let's get into it all right so the first tip on today's list is actually going to be to get the sword now most people might think this is obvious but you'd be surprised how many people actually don't grind with the sword it's honestly a very useful item all right, so this next tip is actually gonna be at the jewelry store. I'm gonna be showing you guys a route that will make your jewelry store robberies much, much faster. Although I should probably be on the criminal team. Okay, now we're on the right team. So essentially I'm gonna be showing you guys a route in the jewelry store that will get you stuff very fast. So essentially what you wanna do is right when you come into the store, you wanna come over here, punch this one. This is the first one you wanna get. Then you wanna instantly hop over here and get this one. Then jump over and get this one. And yes, you can get it through. Then you want to get this one. Then you want to get this one. Then you want to instantly jump over. Then you want to go to here. Get this one. Get this one. Get this one. Get this one. And then exit like normal. Now you just want to turn in your money and boom. All right, so this next one is actually at the gas station. Now this might sound very minor, but most people will actually go in through this door or in the case of the donut shop, will go in through the front door. But what you don't know is for the donut shop, you can actually jump through the window on the other side and for the gas station, you can go through the back door. This makes the robbery a lot faster because you're right next to the cashier when you come in. That might not sound like a big deal, but it actually makes a lot of sense when it comes to robbing public servers because police can come up to you and they can come instantly the second they get that notification and get you out. This is a much more efficient way to rob the store and I'm going to showcase it also on the donut shop. Alright, so if you come to the donut shop and you park right here, you can actually jump through this window right here, go in, instantly rob the store and get out. This is so much faster than going through the front door. Another thing is that it's a lot easier to escape because a lot of police don't know about this and will go through the front door and you can just run out here, get your robbery, and dip. Alright, so with this final tip is actually going to be with the airdrops. Now this tip is PC only, so if you're not playing on PC or computer, then just skip to the next section. So anyways, what you want to do here is if you're on PC, go into F11 or out of full screen and you'll see this bar up here It says Roblox. And what you want to do is hold E on this and then right click your mouse on the Roblox uh, white bar. Now what you should notice is that the timer stops and everything in the game freezes. So now the game is actually still running server side, but on your client it's frozen. Nothing can happen. You can't get damaged. So you, what you want to do is just sit here and wait for the crate to open. This is actually a very good way of making money compared to in public servers where people don't actually rob these a lot because it is a very difficult thing to rob. It's very difficult to open these crates due to the people coming down. But using this glitch, you can get them every time, 100% of the time. Now, once you've waited for enough time, all you have to do is let go and boom, it's opened. Now you can go back in full screen and collect your money. Now that I've showed you the grinding strategy, I'm actually going to perform it in a public server. Again, no private servers are needed for this strategy. So I'm going to show you guys a time lapse of me grinding for 20 minutes and getting $100,000 cash. That would mean that I could also get $300,000 in one hour. Anyways, let's get to the montage.
the beneath the bed before you go to sleep keep on i shine you'll surely get burned if you reach out and touch my mind is a battle i'm trying to hide it getting these voices inside to stay quiet under the In just under 20 minutes, I was able to grind $90,878, including my bounty, which an alt account can just simply drop to you. Keep in mind that this was not a full server with many other people stealing my robberies, as you may have noticed when I had to frequently substitute the gas station and donut shop for the cargo train. In a small server, you could easily get up to $125,000 in 20 minutes, assuming others weren't stealing your robberies. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I just thought I'd make at least one video in the summer. Anyways... Port out.